You can go in here elsewhere. Where I'm going? Ah, damn! Why is three dollars? It's the one I'm again. There's something, something, about something wrong with it, huh? <laughs> how are y'all buying groceries? Because I don't even know how we've been doing it. It's just been miracle after miracle. But y'all stay tuned. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Two twenty eight, salt and vinegar. What kind? Not that kind, it's sold out, of course. That's a good price. I'm gonna probably just get that. So you still don't know. I want the LeBron chips, but. You know we should not spend as much time on some chips. Hurry up and buy! You can go here elsewhere. I'm just saying. Okay. This way. If you want Jesus Christ. You can go, you can go. I can still be here. Where I'm going? You can go get whatever you gotta get. Can you decide? Can you go somewhere else? Hurry up. You ain't got to. That don't take a long time.
hundred dollars. I think I'm feeling that. Why is three dollars? This the one I'm again. Yeah. Some, some, some Something wrong with it, huh? <laughs> I can't have Just for now. Dressing. Okay, you can you can go on that. Brown. Probably some hot sauce. On the table. On the job. Oh, you turn the table. Pick it up. <laughs> Red and everything. Mmm, <laughs> might have to have one fried chicken. Mmm. And now that looks good.
Now we've got more than one view on the camera, right? We're gonna have this camera and then there's one in front here. Well, I'm down with every uh, camera. Okay, well, I'm looking down, Ken. You're gonna grab the video.
Scott Berhalter helps the driver yeah, right the shooting. You gonna love it. Killer.
may, but uh, got a text that he had died. Uh, mm. So uh, both the guys would have expired. Damn. That's red bean is very good. So it's the Malaya rice. Oh, yeah. So now we're looking at a double murder, and we're going to see what we can do about finding Mr. Madavi. Madavi may not have the resources to get very far. So the Malaya rice is good. Southwest. Yeah. He's going to get his name out and pictured out to the media, and hopefully get him picked up soon. Mm. Oh, yeah. In the first 48, Tulsa well, well, Homicide well, responded yeah. to the murders of Rodney McGee mm. and Tony mm. Coleman. Discovered surveillance video that captured the shooting. Tracked well, down in the who identified their suspect <laughs> as James Madavi. Put out a bomb for Madavi, but had been unable to find him. Five days later, we begin here at the arrest of a man accused of killing two men at a West Tulsa motel last Friday. James Madavi was booked into the Tulsa County Jail this morning. Got anything to say? Yeah, man. Come on, steal my money. My guy ain't gonna do that. So what's the scoop on how we found him? What have the uniforms told you? Cartwright said they got a call. Acting on a tip. Patrol found Jay in a house belonging to the man who was staying in room 103. Jay, how are you, sir? I wouldn't think Parmesan went on rocket. A couple quick questions for you. <laughs> okay, do you want to talk to me? So James, how come you don't want to talk to me? You don't have nothing to say? They thought they can you know there's more of that for you, right? For murder. Two counts of murder. You sure you want to talk about what happened? Get your side story. Sounds strange. He on the side of the building. On the side of the building. The only curiosity for me is the motive. Whether it was a money issue. I did look and that's it. I have no doubt that he did what he did. I mean, he's got his own reasons why. Only he tells. Was in life. Thanks, sir. Thank you, sir. Better than on the street, hmm? If you do, sleep low, you know, watch what you do. What makes you miss him the most? Smile. You miss the smile. Six months after the murder, Rodney McGee's family remembers him. The first oh, words she said to me was, Mom, I wasn't ready to, to lose him yet. Sharp but you have to sit back and remember, even though he's not here physically, he's still in our heart. The man that was trying to and I was to very run. proud to say that I, I am Rodney McGee's daughter. I will carry that name with you forever. <coughs> I always remember him being happy. Like, even when times seemed rough, he always gave me happy. <coughs> And he loves people. And it's something that can't be explained. Like, why would you want to take somebody's life? Yeah. Yeah. Well, yeah. You like a little child. <laughs> I hope he can grab one of these from heaven. Like, reach out and grab one. Really? Well, I don't want to see him go. Yes, he can. But I will not let my daddy go nowhere. He's still right here. Right, you can't be going around nobody else. Oh, man. You're making so bad. So the spring is bad, too. You're making me bad. Mm-hmm. Man, you sitting here for the rest of your life, and you're just trying to lie on somebody. People. <coughs> watch who y'all are. Be friends with. 
Cause your friends will be your worst enemy. No, I don't think you did no burgers. It's like you and your friend gonna rob somebody, right? You start shooting back. Y'all start shooting back at them, but you mistake when you shoot your friend. That can happen. You like, hey, you got a nigga right close to you. God will have you take off. But they will. Yeah. You really need to get this guy right down. This might be an puzzle piece there. It don't make sense. Search for justice. You know, I don't want to get out of here. You just have a rock somebody and get your friend turned around. Y'all got this. You just kind of came on. If y'all get good, why the fuck you want to turn on me too, nigga? We got to protect ourselves against you. That's why I feel like it's what's for real. Like, I don't want to be in the same place as you. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like, you know, I'm not going to be in the same place as you. I know one. One of the residents Tell the truth. I mean, don't tell the truth because that's disrespectful. Don't make it stuff. 